Hey everybody, wanted to post a quick video response to Dan Brown's video called Wyoming and WikiLeaks in which he asked if an organization like WikiLeaks had been created 75 years ago, what would be different? Specifically, I wanted to address the question of would Hitler have been able to come into power if the information had been shared as it was, as it is being is currently. I think it's a bit naive of us to say if people have more information they're going to make, you know, the right and better choices because it's very easy to get into that mob mentality which is the way that Hitler became became powerful in the first place. He was able to use his charisma to get the mob talking and word of mouth is the best advertising. It doesn't matter what anybody else is saying of you. A truly corrupt dictatorship is going to keep information very, very secure and very, very controlled as to what their population is going to understand and, and view. And so even if an organization like WikiLeaks had existed during the time and of the rise of Nazism and Hitler, I think that the information would have still been so constricted and spun in a way that it wouldn't have mattered. Hitler rose to power through his charisma, not through his policy or his information or any of that. He was really just a charismatic leader that was there right at the right moment. I think one of the consequences of, a, of an organization like WikiLeaks is breeding a little bit of distrust. And if the American people had truly distrusted their government during World War II, I don't think that they would have been so gung-ho about funding and participating in the war itself. And therefore, I think Hitler would have had an easier time maintaining power. Maybe not his rise to power, but his maintenance of power would have been much easier to, to handle. Mainly because the American people would not have wanted to go stop him. They would have been too mired in their own uh, mistrust of each other and of their government and of their military and everything else to really go forward with a, with a war. It is 3.30 in the morning, so I don't know exactly how much that's made sense, but those are my thoughts initially and uh, right after I watch Dan's video. So uh, thanks guys for listening and watching, and I will see you tomorrow on Friday with a new video.